Hi, this is Guru Prasad. Today, I'm just going to show you how to access the Twitter via Visual Studio 2010. This is just going to be quite interesting and also quite the easiest way to get it accessed via uh, Visual Studio. I mean, getting um, social networking done with Visual Studio. Wondering how? Here we go. All you got to do right now is just launch your Visual Studio 2010 from Start Visual Studio. This is going to be quite interesting and also easy to do um, the way of accessing all the latest Twitter feeds or tweets via feeds, RSS feeds on Visual Studio. Now, you have three tabs in front of you. Get started, guidance, and latest news. All you got to do is click on latest news, and here you can find the RSS feed box where, where you can enter your feed URL, and by this way, we are going to access all the Twitter feeds here. Yes. Now, let's step into... Uh, the way how to access the Twitter feeds via this feature available in Visual Studio Start page. Okay, now you can question me, how do, how do you access all your Twitter feeds via Visual Studio? Yes, we are just going to use the RSS feature which is available on Twitter. You, can, you have two ways to get your RSS URL that is either by just logging on to twitter.com and log on to your Twitter and you can access your RSS feeds on your previous version of Twitter or the alternate way would be using this URL which helps you to pull up all the RSS feeds or all the latest timeline updates via RSS. So here we go. This is going to be the URL syntax http colon double slash twitter dot com slash statuses slash user underscore timeline slash your username dot rsys okay just let me give a try whether it really tries to update yes now I'm just gonna access my Twitter account I'm sorry and gonna update something over here yes I'm done so let me confirm whether my tweet has been updated yes it is now let's go ahead and check on Visual Studio whether my feed I mean my tweets are available as RSS here we go let me try copying this URL and pasting it over here and changing my username instead of the default syntax and I'm just gonna hit the refresh button hola here we go here I here I'm getting the list of uh, latest tweets which I have done and I mean which can be available on RSS let me just try copying the same URL and trying it on the browser Now let's compare both the pages. Yes. 
both are same. So what does it mean? So here, the latest tweet, the all my tweets, all my tweets under timeline can be visible or it will be visible on this RSS page. So when I just click on it, what happens? It just takes me to a page. It just takes me to a Twitter page where I can view only the tweet. Yes, I'm done. So this is the way how you can access your Twitter feeds via Visual Studio. And that's all from me for our today's content. And you can ca catch me at facebook.com slash groupresa.balaji or you can reach me over Twitter at gp underscore me. Thank you.